I got this new album coming out, man. I've been working on. Um, I tried to have it finished before 2018 ended, but uh, don't look like that's gonna that's gonna work out for me. Don't look like that's gonna work out for me. Uh, I've been grinding, man. I've been grinding. I've been uh, just every chance I get, I'm mixing down music. You know, it's like I'm a uh, I'm on I'm on um I'm on a wall like Nehemiah, I just can't come down right now. That's a lot of things I wanna do. Uh but I'm passionate about this and I gotta get this out. Um I got a couple of people I'm featuring on my album, man. I um you know, you no know, doing gospel rap, man, it's 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 man it's real. You want people who who who's really living the lifestyle on the on on you know what I'm saying on your music you know what I'm saying um, just not say you're gonna do everything perfect man but you know we just try you know so I got a couple of cats I got featured on my um, albums really gonna be the first time I really got somebody featured on my on my album if you listen to any of my albums shoot man it's just me it's just me three albums in I'm on my fourth I'm gonna pay my way to you know, to get where I'm at, man. I spent thousands of dollars, so, so many studio hours, man. From rapping in the studio to recording, using the bathroom as a studio, using the closets as a studio, motel, man. I did it all, bro. I did it all. This music game is for real. I got partners, you know what I'm saying, that's... Uh, Real deep in the music industry, you know, making noise, you know what I'm saying, working for big time companies. But um, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna make everybody hear me this time, you know. My album, uh, my first album, my brand new, it didn't really come out like I wanted to. It was pretty much uh, I was trying to bring a new flavor, you know what I'm saying, to the music industry. I was kind of scared at the same time because I. For years, I was doing gangster rap, and then I just flipped to the gospel rap like in the blink of an eye, man. A lot of people, you know what I'm saying, really didn't, weren't, weren't really feeling the album. And uh, my brand new didn't, didn't really do good uh, to a lot of people's standard, but to my standard, man, it's God be the glory cause. I dropped that album in 2006, man. And, the album been selling all over the world since 2006. I'm not trying to be braggadocious. I ain't really seeing no money off of it. Everybody got a cut in the money, man. But man, I done sold that album, man, all over the world three or four times, man, from Japan to Australia, Germany, um, United Kingdom, Great Britain, Mexico, Peru, Brazil, man. Netherlands, Singapore, you know, this goes on and on, man. That's been doing that since 2006. I got a lot to be proud of. There's people listening to my music, man. I, I might not never see them or hear from them, man, but it's it's reaching some people, man. And so I've been reaching people in the name of Jesus, man, um, like that for a while. Um, my um, second album that I did was called RebornRapper.com. Man, I finished uh, 14 tracks on that thing, man. I had a producer, and I had a manager. And um, my manager and producer got into it, you know what I'm saying, over financial stuff. And um, after I finished the album, the whole album was scrapped. <laughs> man, my whole album was scrapped, man. They scrapped the whole album, man. Then my music was on the internet. It was it wasn't selling good, man. When you hit my music, like some folk music could come on, man. So I'm listen. I'm I'm trying to get my music straight for about a year, bro. And uh, every time I cut on my music, it's uh some like music. It's, it wasn't even me. So I was battling that. Finally got that situated. Uh, I did this album called. Uh, Rapping to the world, and I believe that's by far been my best album. 
I believe it's by far my best and my worst album, man. The reason I say that is because, uh, man, this songs on there, man. I know, I know, it should be platinum, man. But the production on it is so whack, man. I had like three masters put on it. Didn't nobody know what they were doing. They were doing the masters, so man, it's like that. I was spending money and messing up my songs at the same time, man. I just like, man, I gotta go and get this out. So. What I end up doing, man, I was getting loans, bro. I was, I was going broke, bro, trying to get my album out, man. You know what I'm saying? Saying, man, this this was it. This was it. Man, I went so, man, I went broke behind that, bro. Then the loans, man, I was getting to, to get my music done. Everybody think I'm balling out of control, bro. I was getting loans, man. You know what I'm saying? For studio time, man. And I had bills. On top of bills, bro, and loans. <laughs> Say, man, I know what sacrifice look like, man. You know, but God that gave me a word. And I'm like, man, it got to be, it got, it got to hit on this one. It's got to hit on this one. So I'm going by faith. You know what I'm saying? And um, it didn't happen. Matter of fact, I don't even sell that album on the internet, man. I sell that out the chunk of my car, and I sell that album when um when I'm performing. So, um, so yeah, but I believe that's the best album I got, man. I just wish the production was, was, was good on it, man. It was better. Um, so that's album number three. Remember album number two, never to even get the release. So I never even, man, I don't even have a copy of that thing, man. I had 14 songs done, bro. I only have a copy of it. Um. So the albums that count that I still sell is uh, my brand new, that was my first one, um, uh, rapping to the world in. That's the one I'm talking about now. And um, the last album I've done, man, around 2016, 2017, was um, God Chasers. God Chasers, man. God uh, gave me the name to that album, man. Um, in church, man, and uh, the vision for the album. Uh, so that that's it's more sentimental to me than anything. God Chasers. Um, the album God Chasers, man, is basically um, an album made just for inform. It's an information album, um, pretty much informed it on the things I've studied throughout the years, the way I feel, uh, talking about things from conspiracies in the spiritual realm natural uh, praise and worship to um, hip-hop. Um, my brand new, the first one, it was more about uh, trying to get people to feel my style, my flow. Uh, rapping to the world in was a bounce back from all the drum I had from my brand new man was not being able to get my music um, right on the internet for about a year. and. Um, you know, I just gave up, man. I just gave up. I'm like, man, having a whole album done and it just flopped where it didn't even get to come out. So, man, I took a period of years, man, where it was real hard for me. I was still writing and, you know, I really wasn't writing as much as I as I used to. I didn't have the drive for it. Um, so uh, when I done... Um, rapping to the world and rapping to the world it was my signature, yeah, I'm back. It was more like, man, I'm back, man. Big C back on the on the mic, on the ones and twos, man. I finna let these boys have it, man. So um got some real I got I got some heat on that song. Um uh, I mean I mean on that album, I'm sorry, I got some heat on that album, man. You know, I got I get mad at the world, so I sag my pants was the first song on there. It don't even sound Christian, bro, but I just wanted to let the world know how I felt from inward point of view using an out a outward reflection man and um I had some heat on that on that album man I had some heat on that album um back to God Chasers God Chasers man was more informative uh, I felt it was good but I think it could have been better that was the first album I produced the whole album myself um so uh I feel like man um I had a I had a couple of nice songs on there, a lot of songs, you know, I really wasn't feeling them. I, you know, I feel like I pretty much was struggling to put the album out, but man, people, people, man, 
they jumped on it, man. They jumped on it. My song, um, But God, actually pushed that album. But God has been pushing that whole album, even right now. You know, But God pushed the whole album, you know. Um, so um, through all these years, I've just been accumulating music, right? Just been accumulating music, so man, I got so much music, and I'm like, the rap game is changing, and it's um, so these youngsters, man, they hot. These cats hot out here, man. These boys, man, they not playing, man. Like, they 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 coming with some heat. I love it. I love it. Um, so I feel like I had to bring some heat too. So. The album I'm working on right now, man, I really don't even want to disclose the name. But uh, it's lyrically, lyrically inclined, man. The, the lyrics on it, man, is on a whole nother level. I don't gave a taste of a song, you know. But, man, that's not even that's not even the, the tip of the iceberg, man. I, I don't gave a taste of a song that I had performed not too long ago that's going to be on the album. But man, that's just one of many, man. You just listen to the tracks, man. I got some heat. I got some lyrics. Some of my lyrics are phenomenal, man, on this album. Um, again, not trying to be braggadocious, man. Just I just got confidence in this in this album, man. And uh, this album gonna have a little bit of everything. It's a little bit of everything. It's in the making, man. I'm I'm nine and a half songs deep. <laughs> nine and a half, right? Yeah, I'm nine and a half songs deep, man, and uh, I can't wait to see what the world going to think of this one, man. I believe uh, the mark that I've been wanting to put out for the last 20-some-odd years, man, 30 years, man, you know, close to, it's going to be in this one. I've turned down a lot of music, man, uh, a lot of music opportunities, man, out of fear, um, I was I was some things that was whack in the past that could have caught up with me. So uh, man, I done had some hookups from Universal Records to this, that, and the third. But a lot of stuff got gangster in my life, and I, you know, I had to turn it down. I had to turn it down because I didn't want nothing to catch up with me. Um, yeah. So, so yeah, man. Um, you know, I've been saved for, for a while now, bro. I've been saved for a long time. You know, um, I've been representing God, man, for real. I ain't always did it right, but uh, I got my studio right here, man. I got my studio just in my living room, bro. I get zoned out, you know. Hopefully, I can go full-time producing sometime in the future. I think this album right here will really... Um, be a portrait of how I feel and the compassion I have for music. And, uh, man, uh, so uh, I'm going to keep y'all in tune, man, and um, show a little bit more about the music industry with you. And um, I ain't, my ain't went gold, my ain't went platinum. I've been around the bush. God bless. Your boy Big C, peace.